Hello everyone and thank you for watching. In this episode, we travel south from our base camp near Glen, New Hampshire to North Conway and then west to Lincoln to see exciting waterfalls, mountain creeks, historic covered bridges and incredible autumn foliage on the Kankamagas Highway. From Florida to Alaska, from the East Coast to the West Coast, join Steve and Jane celebrating their 50th anniversary as they explore America in the cool Nana Coach, their 27-foot-4 Freedom Elite motorhome, as they visit the many points of interest in our beautiful country on their golden anniversary adventure. As we depart Vermont on U.S. Route 2, toward the White Mountains of New Hampshire, we pass through the quaint town of West Danville, with its historic covered wooden pedestrian bridge at Joe's Pond, named to honor fabled Vermonter Indian Joe, and guarded by a lone stone sentry. continue a pleasant and scenic ride along Route 16 as we come across the famed Mount Washington Hotel. As we continue along the highway to our base camp destination at the Green Meadow Camping Area, where we plan to spend four days. Green Meadow is centrally located in the White Mountains of New Hampshire, and it's a great location for our base camp to reach out to all the points of interest in the general area. After an easy camp setup and restful night, we head out under the rainy skies, south along US 302, into the town of Conway, where the highway eventually splits and then crosses the Saco River with a gorgeous covered bridge. A few miles further brings us to the Saco Ranger Station and the start of the famous Kankamaga Scenic Byway. The Kankamaga Highway was dedicated as the first of the national scenic byways in the Northeast of the United States. Every year, rain or shine, leaf peepers show up in full force 
to drive the Kankamagas Highway just to get a glimpse of the brilliant colored New Hampshire fall foliage. Even the rain can offer a unique experience on the Kankamagas Scenic Byway. The highway stretches across the White Mountains for 34 and a half miles from Conway to Lincoln, climbing to nearly 3,000 feet as it traverses Mount Kankamagas. This is our first stop of several that we'll make, a beautiful picnic spot along the Swift River. The trail to the Boulder Hills River along with the colorful fall foliage was easy and enjoyable hike. Albany Covered Bridge, located at Pasconaway Dugway Road, just a short distance from the Kakamagas Highway, six miles west of Conway. The Albany Covered Bridge was first constructed in 1858. Repairs and restorations over the years have kept the bridge in usable condition. The site has a large parking lot that will accommodate buses and restrooms are available there. Turn left on West MNF Campground Road, yeah, then take serious. the second right. Yeah. Over the Absolute incredible beauty here on the Kank, as the locals call it. 
on our way to our next exciting stop. It's supposed to be very beautiful. They call it the Lower Falls. Look at that crystal clear water. Wow. And the size of these boulders? Imagine these boulders were placed here by the glaciers as they moved through what's now the Swift River. Well, Jane's got her walking stick ready. I guess she's ready to go for a hike. Saturday Falls, a relatively easy, but somewhat steep, seven tenths of a mile hike on a gravel trail borders the waters from the falls as the elevation increases some 100 feet above the trailhead. What unparalleled beauty! This is what draws thousands of people to visit New Hampshire in the fall to see the incredible color change the pristine mountains, the crystal clear water, and look at the colors of these rocks. And there's still lots more to come as we continue our trek up the hill to the Saturday Falls. Falls are a picturesque series of cascades in a narrow flume. Wooden boardwalks and bridges, along with many, many stairs, assist the hikers on their hike to see the eye-popping, roaring Sabine Falls with its 45-foot initial drop through the awesome stone crevices.
You can practically touch the clouds here as you view Mount Kankamangas to the south and the 3,700 foot Mount Huntington to the north. Located on the Hancock branch of the Penajawasset River, Otter Rocks is a perfect site, a beautiful site, in fact, for a picnic. Lincoln Woods. This pretty well marks the end of the Kangamongas Highway. Besides the ranger station, an historic pedestrian suspension footbridge over the Penajawasset River is well worth the short hike from the parking area. Please don't forget to click that subscribe button and ring the bell so you'll be notified of our next adventure. As always, thank you so much for watching.